What's going on everybody? What's going on? Welcome to another Animal Crossing helpful tips video right here for you on youtube.com slash the game leaders. Thank you guys so much for coming by another video. Now if you just clicked on this video then that means that you might be interested in Mr. Crazy Red himself and his treasure trawler coming over to your island. Now this video is basically going to show you how you can infinitely spawn Mr. Crazy Red himself on your island. Now, a little PSA to start the video. I need to let you know up front. If you are not a time traveler, then you really just need to click off this video. Now, the information may help you, but ultimately, this is going to require time traveling. And if that's something that you're just not interested in then trust me i definitely understand i understand being uh completely dedicated to not time traveling in animal crossing new horizons now with that being said let's go ahead and talk about how you're going to infinitely spawn crazy red on your island so the very first thing what i need you to do is I need you to time travel till Crazy Red spawns on your island. Now, what that's going to involve is going forward one day at a time until Crazy Red spawns for you. Now, if for some reason you already have Crazy Red on your island, then you are G2G. That means you are good to go. So, the first step time travel till you have crazy red on your island just like i ha do in the video you've been watching so far then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and buy whatever you want from him go ahead and buy a real or a fake painting do whatever you want to but this is definitely going to help you increase your museum collection now after you do that, go ahead and time travel one day forward and pick a specific time. So in my example, I am picking 8.30 p.m. because I know unequivocally that he is spawning at 8.30 p.m. for me. So go ahead and pick 8.30 p.m. or whatever time that you want to pick. Go one day forward. Now that you are one day forward, go ahead, check your mail. Grab the stuff that Crazy Red sent you, and you can open it, put it in your pockets, do whatever you want. Okay, so then now what you're going to do is before you hit save, go ahead, go back to system settings, go back to the day that he spawned. In my example here, it's April 20th, so currently we're on April 21st at 8.30ish p.m. We're going to go back to 4.20 at around the same time. So I'm going to go ahead and set my system clock to that specific time. I'm going to save the game, and then when I reopen it, it's going to be at 420 at that specific designated time now what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go ahead and walk over to the area which is our secret beach to where crazy red spawns and as you guys see crazy red is here again so now we're gonna be able to go talk to crazy red and grab art again so just to kind of button it up basically the steps are Go ahead, time travel until you get Crazy Red. Then, make a purchase. Then, go ahead and time travel one day to the future. When you time travel to that day, do whatever you want. Go buy something or just simply save, move your clock back again to the prior day. It's going to respawn Crazy Red with brand new art. And then, you're going to be able to completely keep wash rinsing and repeating this process until you feel satisfied whether that is filling up your museum with art or just getting a bunch of really cool art pieces for your island guys that has been another helpful tips video right here on how to spawn crazy red infinitely make sure you subscribe don't forget to do it before you leave and like the video if you like this content dislike it if you hate it which is weird because you're still here till the end so make sure you just like it leave a comment down below any other helpful tips that may help your helpful uh villagers that we have here and we'll catch you guys on the next one for another helpful tips video or a stream of animal crossing every single saturday Bye bye